okay welcome back to this channel and in today's video i'm just to give a answer a question okay that has been bothering a lot that when should i start uh, diversifying my funds or the profit i gain from my farm into other areas okay yes i know a lot of pig farmers after after they have fallen they are very 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 unable okay to rise again why it's not because they, they, are, they are weak physically or no, but they didn't know when to start a new venture, okay? They didn't know when to take money from their farm to other areas, whether agriculture or to, uh, or to finance their lifestyle, okay? Yes, if you're a farmer or in just as in any other business, once you start and then like, you realize the business is booming, okay? And if care is not taken or you divert or you deviate a bit, from the business plan okay you deviate a bit from your business plan you are going to fall completely you fall out of market okay and you'll be missing totally okay so like just in other other business some farmers like big farmers or animal producers okay once they realize that they have made, made a lot of sales okay what they begin to think is no i cannot afford uh, this lifestyle i have been dreaming of this car I wanted to buy this uh, house I wanted to build and this vacation I wanted to uh, take, okay? And they realize that, you, you always realize that after those people have taken money from their business or their farm to venture into those areas, they end up either getting suspended, okay? Suspended in the air or they stand in the, mid, in the middle. They, they cannot finish what they have started, the new ones they have started. And they cannot also invest into their business that was giving them the profit okay so, yes so one was asking that when should i take money from my farm to i mean finance the lifestyle i want okay yes because i know one, one of my my, my my farmers yes my, my let me say my friends okay a very successful pig farmer of course the moment he sold pigs one to it yes he began putting up a building and before he realized swine flu came in and the pigs all died off okay the pigs all died off he too he couldn't finish building now the building is there he has no pigs and he has no other source of income so it's not in the middle i used to whether to sell the the incomplete building to start a new pig farm or to forget about the farm and you can see he was just confused and as i'm talking it is still there like that okay and i don't want you to make that mistake okay know that this is my business and this is where i get my money from don't joke with it i tell you this where you are getting your source of money should be protected at all times okay so before you start financing the lifestyle you want or you start taking money from your business to do what you you enjoy doing like putting up a nice building buying a ring for your that your girlfriend or boyfriend okay you have to put measures in place. Know that you have to secure yourself so that in case anything happens, you can recover quickly. Okay. Yes. So they ask that. So what is the ideal? Uh, what is the ideal uh, duration before I start financing my lifestyle or putting up that building from the profits or proceeds I make from the farm? I said no. I can't give you the exact yes. Okay. And the duration I can't give you. It depends on you, the farmer. Look at how you have started. And the number of pigs you want to sell, okay, before you you you'll be able to say yes to them, okay. And know that once you are doing that, you should be able to put some money aside, so that if any misfortune happens on the farm, you can quickly recover, okay. There are some farmers they even start financing their lifestyle without even uh, securing feed for the animals. They don't even secure feed; they just start putting up on the street. They have sold a lot, so they have started putting that building. No security for the farm. And then they are moving on like that. Focused on their new, their dream home. Building seriously from the profit they made from their farm. And ignoring the farm. So they, later they realized that a uh, swine flu came in. Or the animals, they lose some way. So they are not able to get the profit as they have envisioned it uh, before. And they begin to feel frustrated. Okay. Yes, it's true. That one frustration was setting. 
once you don't put things right frustration will set in so always be able to ensure that if anything should happen on the farm you can quickly recover should it be swine flu or feed shortage as a major pro problem on the farm feed shortage make sure you have been able to secure a lot of the feed okay so you don't have to i mean be wondering or leaving your animals to starve no you are feeding them twice a day twice a day so you don't have to go back and then start feeding them once no 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 in that case the amount you're supposed to get by selling one pig you won't be able to get it again because they are not eating to gain the weight you are supposed to get okay so always ensure that you have enough funds put aside such that if anything should happen on your farm you can quickly go there and then recover and then keep moving you don't have to fall back yes so don't rush or don't be in a hurry to use the profit from your farm you just started pig farming or you started a business and then it is flourishing and you are quickly uh, taking money from it fast fast okay to go and start building no don't do that wait till you know that no at this point i have enough saved and i can start it no matter what happens i will still be able to move on smoothly okay so i think this video i'm i'm not telling you the exact time the exact date for you to start affording that lifestyle you want but know that it, you are dealing with your animals and they are your business okay that's where you get your money from that's where your source of livelihood comes from you and your family you depend on don't be in a hurry to start a new life don't be in a hurry that car can wait that home can wait okay the ring and then the vacation they can all wait but make sure you have secured your farm first yes i think you have really heard something and then you have learned something a bit from the video if you haven't subscribed yet, please do me a favor, clicking on the subscribe button and turning on the notification bell, okay?